Hey everybody, welcome in. If this is your first video with me, welcome back if it is not. Either way, I'm so excited that you're here and I'm really grateful you've decided to spend just a little bit of your day with me today. Today, we are gonna be opening some Dumbo Wishies. You guys know how much I love wishables. I don't wanna wait another second. You wanna rip these guys open? Let's just get started, shall we? I'm Rachel and this is Attainable Disney. You guys, I feel like it has been a hot minute since we've done some wishies. And I've, I've said this before. I used to buy every wishables that came out because I love them so much. Then they changed the price. They're $14.99 each. And now they make them very difficult to get. And so it's like, I can't do that anymore. So it's definitely been a minute, but the Dumbo ones called to me. So here I am. First, let me show you, oh my gosh, the little open stock Timothy Mouse. <gasps> oh my God. Is he the cutest? So I had to get him. You know, I don't always buy those open stock ones. Again, they're expensive and these ones tend to be easier. Like these guys tend to be easier to get. So I don't always buy them, but too cute. So let's talk about our choices here, Dumbo. Casey Jr., Mrs. Jumbo, and the Stork. I do also know that there is a chase of Dumbo with the makeup on, which is cruel, but I also want it. <laughs> so here's the thing. I know I have a source. And by source, I mean a guy who posts in a Facebook group. This man, I don't know who he is. He doesn't like work for the parks. Like, we don't know who he is, but he always has the information and he's never wrong. He's never wrong. But every month, like a month prior or sometimes even two months prior, he knows what the wish bowls are gonna be, right? Like he said in like April, like we knew that they were gonna be Dumbo in June, right? Like he always know. And he said that this was the last series of wishables. He said that Disney's discontinuing wishables. I don't want to believe it either. I mean, obviously Disney has not said anything. I haven't heard anything about a series for July. Like, I don't know, but I'm just throwing it out there that like, it's entirely possible and likely that this may be our last Wishables opening ever. All right, so now that I've bummed you guys out, let's open them. I've got five because I want all five. Ooh, you guys know I'm no good at feeling them from the outside, but as soon as I put my hand in, I know what this is. Ready? One, two. Oh my God, I was so wrong. I felt the hat and I thought it was Dumbo. So what do I know? Okay, so we have the stork. Oh my God. I'm just looking at it. it, makes me so sad because I don't want this to be the last one. Number two. One, two. Okay. Number three. One, two. See, like, it's so cruel, but like, oh, sweet, oh my God. Oh my God, oh my God, I love you. Oh, don't, oh my God, I love it. Number four, one, two, three. Oh my God, I don't need any more birds. Okay. This one is very big. If I had to guess, I'd say it was the train, just cause it's huge. Like I can't even get my hand in here. One, two, okay. So it's the train. 
I mean, I wish that, like, this part was open. Like, wouldn't that be cool? Like, the, almost like the Ratatouille vehicles. Like, if this part was open and then they could, like, sit in it. Um, yes, that would be better. All right, let's review. We got Chase Dumbo, Casey Jr., and three freaking birds. So, I'm looking for a Mrs. Jumbo and a regular Dumbo. And it's good because I've got some birds to trade. So, here's the thing, guys. I'm not ready for Wishables to be over. You guys, I love Wishables, even with the price increase, even with how difficult Disney makes, like, makes it to get them. I'm just, I'm not ready. I love them. And I feel like there is more to be done with them. So, like, if you look at the back of this, it says, Wishables are the magic of Disney parks come to life. So, even if we're just focusing on the parks, I still feel like there's more to be done. But I also feel like it doesn't need to just be the park. Can I get some Marvel Wishables? Like, I know we've got the two sets, or we have got the one set of Guardians, right, from the Mission Breakout. Maybe we do a second set of Guardians with, like, I haven't even been on the new ride, but like maybe we branch out a little bit. Can I get a web slingers? So can I get some, even some like, maybe it could just be like an Avengers campus one. Maybe the like with an Ant-Man or Spidey. Can I get some Rise of the Resistance? Can I get a cute, cuddly Kylo Ren? Hello. I don't know. I'm just saying like, even if we're just doing parks and rides, I feel like there's a lot left. I do think if we want to keep it to the like resorts, motif i still think there's other stuff like can we do the resorts so like think about so think about when you're at animal kingdom right and you see the characters at the restaurants and stuff in their re resort safari outfits can i get a set of that right like kind of like the alani ones or like some of the restaurants like the grand floridian has that park fair restaurant where they do the Mary Poppins thing. So can I get a Mary Poppins? Is it Disney Parks? I mean, they did a Coco set. I mean, there's no Coco ride. I mean, I guess there's like some Coco stuff in the Mexico Pavilion. They did the villain set. Where's Hades in the park? I don't, so if Disney's saying it has to be the parks, I still think there's park stuff to be had. I don't think it needs to be the parks. I think that there's still lots of stuff to be left. So here's what we're gonna do guys. In the comments below, I uh, hear or come follow me on Instagram and we could do it in the comments over there on this post or whatever. But like, let's make a list of wishables sets that we want so that Disney knows that wishables aren't over. All right, guys. Well, I will see you in the comments because we have some work to do. Also, if you want to trade, if you want some of my birds, let me know. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.